Okay guys, so as you may know, we had quite a lot of space at the back here um, and we weren't too sure exactly what to do with it. People had given us a number of ideas. Some people had suggested that we build some other flats on it and you know, a whole lot of different ideas. Someone even said build a shop, but I thought it would be a great idea if we did some farming. What the hell do I know about farming? Absolutely nothing. <laughs> um, but anyway, I thought it would be a good idea for us to plant some things so that we can start moving towards being self-sufficient. So in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how far we've gotten. Um, we're gonna also be joined by my dad, who's gonna be walking us through, careful dad, um, and gonna be showing us around the farm. So you're gonna to have to call me Farmer Nay from now on. So this is our little makeshift fence to really to stop the dogs from um, from coming in. But we have seen that the dogs can jump this fence easily. So we're going to be using a different solution <laughs> to prevent the dogs from coming in. Yeah. Right, so dad, take us around the garden. Show us there's different bits. Okay. So. so this one is, um, this is coriander. Coriander we're growing here. Yep. And this one, the second one here is thyme. Yes. And then uh, this third one is the Brussels sprouts. Now, I have to say, I don't know why we're growing Brussels sprouts because the only person that likes Brussels sprouts in this family is my little sister, Leah. And she don't even live here. So yeah. as soon as those come up, oh, those... We should be planting them out. Oh, gosh. Out here. Uh, yeah, well... So this section is all become this. Those Brussels sprouts are going to be given away, guys. I'm not interested in Brussels sprouts at all. So this is cucumbers that we've got grown here. I think I'll put in a clip... Um, of some of the massive cucumbers that have come up from what we've grown. But I'm going to see if I can find a few. Ah! I almost fell down. Okay, look, my dad's found one. That's not... Uh, that's a small one. A small one that's not quite ready to come up yet. But guys, they get massive. There's a few others in there. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, we've got a couple. More. Some other ones which are... Um, a bit oh, yeah. Here's some more. Uh, that's another one. This one too, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I see that. Okay, so we've got cucumbers growing in this first section here. The produce of the land is simply too much for our family alone. And so we deliver some to one of our favorite restaurants in Accra. We share with our neighbors, our friends, and our family members. It feels really good. And then let's go to the next section. Okay. You joining us, Ree? Okay. In granddad's slippers. <laughs> oh, but dad, hold on. What is this? I'm seeing these things here along the way. Oh, these are water. This is to uh, irrigate. This is to water the plants. These plants. So, um, we will have the holes yeah. to there, and then the sprinkler will sprinkle around and we'll water all the crops for us. So we've got a little bit of a sprinkler system going as well. Cool. This is another mango tree. These things just spring up all the time from everywhere. Okay, what have we got here? Oh, lettuce. lettuce. So we've got quite a bit growing over there. This first one is cucumber. There's more cucumbers there, but I think they've they've harvested most of the ones that are ready, but there's some more small ones growing. So you've got lettuce growing here. And guys, this is, this oh, is this one is cabbage. Oh, cool. Okay, so we've got cabbage growing on this row. These are, these are so now we did some, you know, we've got some of the seeds we bought from the UK. Um, I literally ordered some seeds on Amazon. <laughs> And they came delivered next day. Thank God for Amazon. And here, what we have? What do we have? These are carrots. Oh, we've got carrots coming here. Yeah. Cool. Oh, I've seen some mangoes bearing on this little tiny tree. Careful, Rian. <laughs> okay, in this section, whoa, we've got tomato growing. Let's have a look. 
Is anything growing? Uh, Nothing's growing here. Once you Can I walk here? Oh, uh, um, right, I won't. I won't walk there then. Okay. Ah, oh, so we've got tomatoes coming here. Oh, look, so this one is flowering. Yeah, once this is a flower, then the tomato will come from there. Excellent. All the way down to the end. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not really keen on walking all that far, but go back, baby. And look, what do we have here? Banana? <laughs> is it banana or planting? Um, this would be banana. Is it? I think because it didn't grow big. We didn't grow it very big. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. This is another, um, an avocado tree, right? Yeah, that's avocado. Wait, where's the one that we planted? Yeah, we're going to show them the one that we planted. Right. We'll find out. So this is, uh, this one is a mango. This one, mango. This first one. Yeah, this one is avocado. Second tree here, avocado. And this one is another avocado. Another avocado. Let me see if I can show you. Um, all right. If you come here. Um, oh, wow. Okay. All of these, uh, if you look that side, I see, see it. The, the hair. They're bearing. Yeah, they're bearing. You see that? Uh, Guys, I don't know if you can see. Oh, I've lost it even in the, in the thing now. Is. Hold on. No, no, it's avocado. Guys, it's avocado. I can't believe it. Dad, how long ago did you plant tree, this? this? This tree must have been about three years old. Yeah. Yeah, three years old. But it bore, mm. you didn't see it because it was covered by um, these um Oh, the plants. Trees. Okay. But this big avocado. You cut these all down. Let's see if I can find some of these avocados were on the floor. Is it? Yeah, big ones. What? I wanted to see them. How foolish. So you, you missed it. Missed it? Yeah, but by February, by um, April, they should be big enough ready to be eaten. There's some more growing there. Uh, yeah, there were some on the floor here. Uh, big ones are like this. Is it? Oh, oh, I don't know, you missed it. Terrible, oh, yeah. terrible. Okay, here's another one. Here's another avocado, but this one hasn't started bearing yet. Another avocado tree. Okay. Ah, then Rian, you can go and show them your one. Go on. Where, which one's mine? Over there. Go, go. Lead the way, Ri. Wow. wow. So we planted these ages ago. I can't tell you when. But we didn't even Last think that... Year, oh, when was it, Ri? Last year, October. Last year, October. And... No, it was 2022. This is 2022. Oh. It couldn't have been. It couldn't, we couldn't have planted it in 2022, didn't it, Dad? Yeah, we did. Or was it? Was it this year? Yeah, it was this year. Early this year. Okay, early this year. Shame, I'm wrong. So early this year, we planted these two avocado trees. One here and one over there at the back near the back wall. I can't believe they're still alive. They're growing well, though. Yeah. Oh, my foot. Yeah, I think there will be some potatoes that will grow. Potatoes? Uh, yeah. Okay. And then you got the corn, I think you want to do the corn that side. Okay. Yeah. But you see, they've got plenty of land, so there will be lots, lots more vegetables that will be grown. So they grow here. Good, good. So here's the beginning of the new solution to keep the dogs out of the farm. You see, the dogs would jump the old fence and they completely destroyed the sprinkler system. These mischievous little dogs of ours. So we had to get in some people to build us a real good fence. So far, so good. The dogs can't jump it. So every evening during the dry season, the gardeners come back to the property to ensure that it's fully watered, uh, both at the front where we have the grass growing as well as a few fruit trees, and at the back where we have the farm and all our crops growing. Uh, they do this religiously and of course it's not going to be required during the rainy season, where thankfully the skies will do the job for us. But for now, we've got to make sure that our crops are watered. I've got some planting growing here. Sweetie, excuse me, please. So 
<laughs> Did you plant this? I don't think I planted this one, you know. I, can't, I don't know who planted this one, just came up on its own. <laughs> We've got lots of mangoes as well. Am I? Yeah, that one is rotten. Yeah. The only thing I don't really like about having these mango trees in here is that I see bats in the night flying around these trees. Wow, look how many bunches there are. No, 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 not right now, please. Is she too excited? She's too much trouble. So that's it, guys. That is a little snippet of our farm, <laughs> well, our garden, the things that we have growing. And um, the cucumbers taste nice, though, guys, isn't it? I haven't tasted the lettuce. I don't really like lettuce, but the cucumbers that we've gotten from the garden taste really, really good. So guys, this is one of the avocados, one of the pears that came from our garden, our farm. I'm really proud of this. I'm about to taste it. Wish me luck. Guys, so it's time for me to sample the goods from the garden. I'm about to have some of this avocado. If it tastes bad, my face will say it all. Creamy, nice, very, very nice. I am impressed. Mm -hmm. Wow, I need to get everyone to taste this. I wish you guys were here, wish you could taste. Unfortunately, I think I could end up eating this whole avocado by myself. I better not tell my family because they're going to want to taste some as well. This is nice. 
Okay guys, so that's it. You've had a glimpse of our garden stroke farm. You've seen some of the goods, some of the goods, some of the crops, some of the plants, some of the things that we've planted and that we're gonna be growing. I think Ren wants to sell it. We've given some away to some of our neighbors who have really, really appreciated it. Um, we've sent some off to one of our favorite restaurants here in Accra. Uh, maybe I'll send my two children to the market to go and sell for real. Anyway, that's it from me. See you later.